It's been more than a week since anyone has seen this Gwinnett County teenager after she simply walked off campus on the last day of school. While the majority of teenage runaways do return home, three quarters of them return in a week. We're about to move beyond that time since Nevaeh disappeared from this Gwinnett County High School. <laughs> Fourteen year old Nevea Ashley Bell was last seen leaving Parkview High School around 10 30 a.m. on May 24th after finishing up her freshman exams. School surveillance cameras captured her putting her laptop and book bag under her 17 year old sister's car in the parking lot before placing her debit card on top of the car's windshield. She has not been seen or heard from since. Her parents describe her as a gamer who can be a bit quiet and antisocial at times. According to her father, she normally leaves school with her older sister. However, on the day of her disappearance, she left school 30 minutes early, leading her parents to believe that she may have met someone online. They believe that she possibly met up with someone that she had been talking to through a gaming app. After speaking with some of her friends, they said that on the day of her disappearance, she appeared normal and went about business as usual. Her phone was last pinged in the Morrow, Georgia area, roughly a 40-minute drive from her last known location, but has been turned off ever since. As each day passes, her family's fear worsens. Nevaeh is 5 feet 3 inches tall and weighs 145 pounds. She was last seen wearing brown pants and a white t-shirt with black and white converses. The Gwinnett County School District Police Department confirmed it's investigating the case and are actively working to get into Nevaeh's apps remotely for any clues to her whereabouts. Her father says he's trying not to fear the worst. She walked off a of campus here at Parkview High School, but it's unclear when she got onto the main road here which way she went or which where where she was actually headed. Her father says that with every day that passes, he just grows more worried about where she may be. It could be anything. Like, I, I just want to know that she's safe. The father of 14-year-old Ashley Nevaeh Bell says she could be anywhere a week after she walked off of Parkview High School's campus. He just hopes that she's not in any danger. It's harder and harder every morning waking up. Ashley and her sister were supposed to go home together after exams on the last day of school last Wednesday. But by 11 in the morning, her sister called their dad to say that she found Ashley's things, but that's it. My sister went to the car. Her laptop was under the car and her, um, her debit card was on the car. A Gwinnett County school spokesperson says the school police department is handling the case of the missing freshman. There's video of her leaving the campus, but Ashley's father says there's no other cameras in the area that picked up anything else. It could be any, anything could be happening right now. So, I mean, <laughs> I don't want to think the worst, but I'm just praying for the best. District officials say there are no signs of foul play. Bell says he has Ashley's phone and learned that she met someone new on a chatting app. I'm thinking that someone coached her on doing this and and she just left. Her family is sharing flyers online with the hope that even she can see them and know that she's loved. Ashley, if you're watching, come home. No one's mad at you. Just let us know you're safe. We love you. Nevaeh Ashley Bell finished her exams and walked off the campus here at Parkview High School last Wednesday about an hour before the school let out for summer break. With no transportation nearby, police say they don't believe she left alone. These the, the streets are dangerous. She's 14. She don't know too much. Ramon Bell feels sick, thinking of where his teenage daughter, Ashley Nevaeh Bell, might be. The school security cameras show the freshman walking off campus on Wednesday, May 24th. They say Nevaeh put her laptop and book bag under her 17-year-old sister's car in the parking lot and put her debit card on top of the car's windshield. Nobody's seen the 14-year-old since. She had no money, no clothes, no nothing. Ramon says his daughter was quiet and shy without too many friends. He worries she may have been communicating with someone online. Campus police are actively working to get into Nevaeh's apps remotely for any clues to her whereabouts. I think somebody coached her through this because she don't walk nowhere. Nevaeh is five feet, three inches tall and weighs 145 pounds. She was last seen wearing a white shirt, brown tights and white shoes. Ramon says as Nevaeh's phone pinged in a few locations on Sunday in Moro. The family searched everywhere, but no luck. Nevaeh's phone has been turned off ever since. Yes, I do believe she's in danger. I don't even want to think about the worst scenario. I just want her to come home.
Nevaeh's father has set up a GoFundMe to raise money for private investigators, as he feels police are not doing much to help with the investigation. He's also putting together a reward for any information leading to her safe return. The case remains ongoing.